hey, I'm Jesse, and I want to share with you a movement practice that I use to get into my body and totally out of my mind. First of all, just closing down the eyes and feeling into the body. Notice your breath. Notice any restriction in your chest, your rib cage, that may be impairing the breath from fully expanding in the, on the inhale or fully releasing as you empty the breath with the exhale. Open the eyes and I want you to draw your awareness to the very center of your chest. And then we're just encouraging the breath to meet the front of the sternum. The idea is to be as soft through the ribs as possible and as luscious as possible through the breath so that the sternum actually rides on the breath. Good. So once that's happening, we want to start to move from the center of the, of the sternum. So of course, if you need longer, pause the video. You really want to wait for that moment where the sternum starts to respond to the breath without you doing anything but relaxing. And as we move into movement, it's pretty much the same thing happening. We're not thinking about what the movement is that we're creating. Right now we're moving with the intention of creating more space internally and of truly allowing this one point that we've chosen of the body to lead. It, this doesn't mean that the rest of the body can't have a response. But we're clear about the center of the chest being the leader. So just notice the quality of the movement that wants to arise naturally from your chest. Shutting down the eyes can be really useful to allow this to happen. So can bringing the hands to the area that's leading. Good. And then now we're going to switch the part of us leading. We're going to switch it to the crown of the head, so the very top of the head. Allow the movement that you're, that you're doing through your body to minimize as you come into the crown of the head. Just so that as you sink into that place as your new leader, you're sure that it's happening. You're sure you can start to move from the crown of the head. Really helps to have the eyes closed. Crown of the head leading, choosing its way through space. Awesome. And then I'm going to drop the awareness now to the feet. So just taking a moment to sink down into the feet and to really feel the surface that's beneath your feet, socks, maybe shoes, maybe just the floor, maybe you're outside on the earth, just really taking a moment to feel what's available to you sensation-wise for the soles of the feet. And then moving into sensation moving towards sensation moving to create sensation moving truly from the soles of the feet just the soles of the feet good and then what you're doing movement wise simmer down a little bit and find stillness and just notice the energy coursing through the body feel the aliveness of the inner body take a big breath into the center of the chest and as you exhale, feel that breath going to the ends of your arms at your fingertip. And with your next exhale, 
send the energy of the breath all the way down the legs to the toes and out through the toes. One last breath. Draw it in. And as you draw it out, send it up and down the length of your spine, out the tailbone and out the crown of the head. And feel the energy coursing through the body. And from here, the invitation is to keep going with this movement practice, choosing the points of the body, stopping maybe and saying, okay, now it's my shoulders. Cool, now it is my knees. My arms. And you can play with different speeds, different dynamics. And the point of the practice, of course, is to notice and witness the coming online of your body as slowly, bit by bit, incrementally, you wake up and activate all the different parts of the body. And find yourself by the end of the practice fully resting with your awareness inside your inner body. Hope you enjoy this practice.